Brothers and sisters, Pastor Steve coming to you to welcome you to the season of Advent as we seek to prepare our hearts and our minds to celebrate the birth of Jesus and to anticipate his uh, second coming. Um, One of the realities of scripture is that God created us uh, for community, for each other, to be encouraged by each other, to challenge the world with the truth of who God is, that he is gracious, compassionate, slow to anger, abounding in love and faithful, that we do that the best when we do it together. But the fact of the matter is, since the Garden of Eden, uh, we have been driven apart by our own rebelliousness, by our own desires to live life on our terms. In fact, that's what happens at the Tower of Babel, is that God confuses people and sends them into disunity so that they can realize that they can't go at it alone, that they need God and that they need each other, not just to use each other, but they really need each other in this life that we have on this planet. So one of the uh, little no unknown realities about the Christmas story is these wise men, and they come where? From the east, and they show up where? To Jerusalem. Like, what do these foreigners, what are these people that do not seek God, what do these people have, what business do they have in Jerusalem? Well, this is kind of the birth pain, you see, of what God had to do at Babel with the birth of Jesus. He is turning it all around, and the nations literally are starting to stream to Jerusalem again, like Jerusalem is the symbol of of the Garden of Eden on earth, right? And as, he, as they stream there, this reality of what Jesus does, he brings us together again, begins to play itself out. Brothers and sisters, that's our theme here at First Methodist Midland this Advent and Christmas season. Together again, everything that we do is going to be designed, and you know that we need it, to bring us back together around the risen Christ, around the one who was born in a manger so that we can be more fully and completely all that he has made us to be. We look forward to seeing you throughout all the Sundays in Advent. Look below for our Advent calendar that will get you all set. Grace and peace.